Happy New Year. 2023, goodbye to 2022. Do not let people stop you from being great. Try to rain on your parade when you say, oh, this is going to be my year. Yes, believe that every year. See, people say, oh, why do you wait and say, oh, this is going to be my year? Because it's a restart. Companies and businesses, this first quarter, second quarter, third quarter, they got different budgets and different quarters and different amounts that they need to spend and different things like that. So if you're a content creator or entrepreneur or you try to get a record deal, you're trying to get a pub deal, whatever the case is, you know, sometimes different quarters matter for different reasons as far as how much money you can get for things. So do not let anybody with negativity in their heart stop you from claiming that this year is your year. So with that being said, today I'm gonna to give you guys three things to make sure that you get started on a good foot for the new year. And these are, these are just three things that I do personally. And you know, there's more things that you can do, but these are just three of them. And I made a list and ain't that something. The number one thing on my list is to make lists. I think people, especially young people, you know, people who grew up in the times of iPhones and tablets, we take for granted the power of writing things down with paper and a pen. It's something about when I when I write the list out with with my pen on paper, not just in my phone or trying to act like I'm gonna remember it or put it on a tablet. Or something about having that paper like right in front of you at your desk in your workspace, you keep it open. To, your, to the page of what you need to do. And it becomes a habit where, you know, I make lists, I check things off, I get a sense of accomplishment for my day. Cause sometimes my lists will have simple things on it. Like they say, when you get up, you make your bed, take the trash out, you do the dishes, do some jumping jacks, do a couple push-ups, and you already achieved what five, six, seven things in the first hour, two hours of your day. You know, checking things off your list gives you a sense of accomplishment, which, you know, boosts your endorphins and all that serotonin and all these things that make you happy, which, you know, motivates you and roll you into your next accomplishment of the day, whatever that may be. For me, making lists helps me out a lot because I forget a lot of stuff and not, not necessarily because I'm forgetful, because I'm always thinking of, ideas so i want to write them down so what i'll do during the day i have a pad like this just a little pad and i'll write loose ideas at the end of the night what i do is i go to my loose ideas and i organize them getting the detail in your ideas whatever i'm trying to accomplish it gets written down on a list so lists are very important Make sure if you write lists, you also allocate time to read the list, go over the list. Don't give up on it. Like, do it, read it. It seems like it might be a lot of extra work, but it helps out a lot. It helps you remember stuff. Don't think anything is too too small and insignificant to put on the list either. Make sure that it gets done because it's important. So I have some of the most important things on my list, my visions, all that, and I break them down into different pages. You know, some sometimes I even break it down into different notebooks. Like this notebook is for this type of ideas. This notebook is for these ideas. I'm very big on like organization, knowing where all my files are at, where all my ideas are at. With, with everything you do, when you make your creations, save them, organize them, get you some hard drives. These are the type of hard drives that I got. Let me show y'all real quick. I get these SD, you know I mean? I think they like, this is a terabyte. See, one TV. I think they like a uh, hundred dollars a piece, and I got a bunch of them. I got one, two, three, four, five. I put stickers on them so I can tell them apart and know what's what. But like each of these has a different thing. This is my music one right here. This is music. Only thing that's on here is music. This one has all my videos and pictures, like from video shoots, uh, and only like photo shoots and shit like that. That's it, and I just keep all my stuff organized. I always know where it's at. And then within these, the folders is organized. And I took like, maybe like two whole days, like literally like two eight hour days. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna dedicate myself to sitting down and getting all my files. I'm, I'm the type of person, I can't even start working unless my space is clean. I gotta clean up my space. So I felt the same way with my files making, you know, two, three songs a day. We making beats, we we writing for people, we doing all types of things. So I'm like, let me clean my stuff up, you know what I'm saying? But this 500, this I think they're a little bit more than 100, but this is like $500 right here on hard drives, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, y'all wanna go out and 
all wow, this nonsense and all that. Invest in yourself. I be meeting rappers. They don't got hard drives. They don't got computers. Like how you a, how you an artist and not just rappers, just artists, songwriters. How you don't got hard drive? How you don't got? It mostly be rappers though. It mostly be rappers. It mostly be rappers. Songwriters be having having their shit together more than rappers. How y'all don't got hard drives and you call yourself a rapper? How you don't got a computer? How you don't got a microphone? How you don't got these things? But you got chains and you got cars and clothes and drugs, weed, lean, all these expensive leans, but you don't got a microphone? How? 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 How you don't got these things? At least get the bare minimum and then splurge. At least get you a MacBook, a camera, a microphone, like a, basically a studio setup, a MacBook, some nice headphones, some hard drives. What you doing? Stop playing with it. That's the that's the number one thing for me is lists. <laughs> <laughs>